Hello po mga kaborgy, welcome to my channel. So since we are still in the midst of pandemic and uh, mostly sa ating mga kababayan ngayon ay naka-home quarantine pa rin. Kaya isa sa ating mga nakahiligan ngayon ay ang pangulekta, pagtatanim ng iba't ibang mga klase na mga halaman or bulaklak. No others are selling plants and ang iba naman ay nagbabarter ng iba't ibang mga halaman. So Kaway-kaway naman dyan sa mga mahihilig sa halaman. But the big question is, alam nyo ba ang lahat ng pangalan ng mga halaman sa inyong bahay? At saan ba ito nang galing o simula? At ano-ano ang mga um, beneficyo nito sa ating kalusugan? Kaya ang video na to guys ay para sa inyo. So I know that at the end of this video, you will learn something. no? So this is the first part of my video. Um, please guys, before you proceed, don't forget to subscribe and hit nyo po ang notification bell para po ma-update kayo sa ating susunod na mga i-upload. So, anong hinihintay nyo? Let's watch this. Ang halamang ito ay isang Indian rubber bush or tinatawag nating rubber plants, rubber tree. Ito ay galing sa eastern part of South Asia, ang Southeast Asia. Alam niyo ang rubber plant ay nag-i-improve ng indoor air quality according to studies conducted by NASA na ang malalaki niyang dahon ay nag absorb ng airborne chemicals. They absorb exhaled carbon dioxide and convert into breathable oxygen. So from carbon dioxide turns into oxygen. Ito naman ay tinatawag nating watermelon peperomia. It is classified as radiator plants. Ito ay nanggaling sa Northern South America. Alam nyo ba na ang watermelon peperomia ay ginagamit bilang traditional medicine? It can treat headache, acne, joint pains. At ang kanya mga ugat, it help treat fever and aerial parts for dressing wounds. Ito naman ay isang moonlight plant. Kabilang ito sa pamilya ng philodendron. Alam nyo ba na ang philodendron leaves and stems are poisonous or nakakalason? And the juices can cause skin irritation in some people. Kaya magingat-ingat tayo guys sa ibang halaman. Kagaya nito. Ito ay isang horsetail plants. Galing ito sa Europe, Northern America, Northern Africa. Alam nyo ba na ang horsetail plants, it used for fluid retention. It is also good for kidney and gallbladder kasi it can cure or it can remove kidney stone and gallbladder stone. At the same time, it can also cure urinary tract infection or UTI. Ito naman ay isang Maranta Leuconora, also known as prayer plants. Ito ay nanggaling sa Brazilian tropical forest. We have different types of prayer plants. We have red prayer plant, green prayer plants, and also we have Calathea ornata. Alam nyo ba na ang prayer plants, it can help clear the air in our home? by filtering indoor air pollutants or inaalis niya ang masamang hangin sa loob ng ating kwarto or bahay.
Ito naman ay isang wave of love. It is a type of anthurium plants. Tinatawag itong wave of love because it is an ornamental plant that is loved by the king of Java. It usually used as decoration on the palace garden. Alam nyo ba na ang wave of love ay nakakatulong because it can give or it will give a cool air in our room. Kasi the photosynthesis of this a plant will convert carbon dioxide gas into oxygen. Ito naman ay isang begonia plants. Ang begonia contains more than 1,800 different plant species. Alam nyo ba na ang bulaklak ng begonia is to help eliminate headaches. And naaalis nito sa katawan ang iba't ibang mga toxins. All you have to do is to put hot water on the flowers. Ito ay isang poinsettia plants, an indigenous to Central America. It is widely used as a Christmas floral display. Ito naman ay isang Caladium plants. It also known as Heart of Jesus, Elephant Ear, and Angel Wings. Ang Caladium plants have 1,000 name by color. Ito ay nanggaling sa South America. Ito naman ay isang foxtail plants. It also known as asparagus miere. Ito ay galing sa South African region. Alam nyo ba na ang foxtail plants ay namamatay pag nilagay natin sa low temperature or 25 degree below. tawag namin ito ay isang aglonema plants also called as Chinese evergreen ito po ay nanggaling sa Asia and New Guinea so meron po tayong 21 to 24 species ito naman ay isang black alocasia or black velvet Ito ay galing sa Southeast Asia. Okay, ang panghuli naman nating halaman ay tinatawag na snake plants. Okay, we have 70 different types of snake plants. Ito ay nanggaling sa Africa, Madagascar, at Southern Asia. Ang snake plant ay meron po itong beneficyo sa ating kalusugan. It can remove toxic air pollutants like hydrogen chloride causing cancer birth defects. Kaya maganda po ang snake plant sa loob ng ating bahay. Okay, that's the end of our first parts of the video. So, shout out the echo kay Sir Randis Avedra, kay Mam Ma Alma Morales the Gaidas with her mother. And shout out ko kay Ate Intan Nebria. Shout out ko rin kay um, Ate Aling Isik. Um, kung gusto niyo pa mong pa shout out sa next video, 
please um, don't forget to subscribe and i-click nyo po ang notification bell para um, update kayo sa aking susunod na video and uh, go to the comment section po. Yan lang po. Salamat! Thank you.